What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We just sold out 2023 Panini Immaculate Baseball. One box break, round division number eight. Again, guys, everybody gets one division in MLB. Four autographs, two more ability box, uh, cards per box. Here we go. Roll it. We got uh, six and a two eight times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Six, two, eight. Richard, Donna, Nancy. One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight. And I'll west on the AL East. I mean, it's my first one, man. I mean, I've been hitting Bijan autographs, but yeah, this is the first time I got a really, really nice color of Bijan. But, I mean, what am I going to do? <laughs> I didn't know that was going to be there. Thankfully, I've gotten you some nice stuff, though. All right, so 8-8, eight, eight, NL West, Richard, Nancy, NL Central, AL West, Richard, NL East, James with the AL Central, and then Nancy with the AL East. There you go. If anybody wants to trade, I'll give you guys a quick minute. If not, we are going to close the trade window. Also, too, guys, that NT Baseball is down to six. And if we hustle and hurry up, guys, and sell this out, I can snag one more case. Uh, they didn't sell any on IG or Fanatics Live just yet, so there might be one more case left over. Yeah, Rex, earthquakes happen all the time, man, but I think kind of a little bit slow, slow news outlet lately, the first week of 2024, so earthquakes has been a big thing. Uh, but no, I did not feel the one that happened yesterday. I was asleep. It's crazy how earthquakes work because obviously it depends on the fault line. So, like, people, like, hundreds of miles away felt it, but it's because it was part of the same fault line. And even though I, I kind of was close to it, I didn't feel anything. I was sleeping, but, I mean, I should have been able to feel four point something, but I don't know if it felt on the same fault line. So that's that's the kind of weird part of it. It's like my mom felt it, and she was like 60 miles away, you know? And it's crazy because I felt it where, like, I was, like, literally on the fault line, and it was only, like, a 2.1 or something like that, but it felt like a freaking 4 or 5.0. Like, it shook pretty hard. So it just depends on where you're at in the fault line, really. If you're not really on it, even though you're nearby, sometimes you don't really, you don't feel the movement. Which is kind of shocking if you think about it, but. But yeah, my mom called me yesterday, like around 11.30 in the morning. She's like, did you feel the earthquake? I'm like, no. She's like, you were sleeping? I was like, yeah, you just woke me up. <laughs> I think that's what a lot of uh, people say. I don't know if you follow that Dr. Lucy that works for uh, for uh, that one uh, Caltech here in in, in the LA Pasadena area. Um, but yeah, I, I, I follow her on uh, on Instagram or on on uh, Twitter, and she always talks about the earthquakes that happen because people just at her all the time. But yeah, I mean, I think it's a good thing. That a lot of smaller earthquakes happen because I feel like when there isn't any earthquakes is when you can, should kind of be a little, little worried. Although we can't predict them anyways. I mean, it could still happen, but I don't think it's a bad thing that little ones happen here and there. But yeah, if you've never really felt felt one, it's it's kind of crazy, especially like if they're like rolling. You know, or like a wave kind of deal. It's, it's pretty interesting, like, how it works. I remember the one of the bigger ones I felt. Uh, 
Diego Cartaya for the Dodgers. That's an all West going to Richard. The one of the bigger ones I felt was like my summer school of like my junior year. It was like a five point five or something like that. That that shit was crazy. Like Jonathan Clays. Seattle Mariners, that's going to the AL West. Which is Nancy. And then we got a 7 out of 25, Emmanuel Rodriguez for Minnesota. Oh, honestly, you know what, uh, Nick? I, there was a one, there was a time actually where <laughs> there was an earthquake when we were streaming live. I think it was one time when Joe was here, and there was one time when I was here. I remember it, it shook pretty well. I think we were just afraid of the glass breaking, you know? Uh, Minnesota, AL Central, going to Nancy. But it just depends. Like I said, I feel like everybody's had their own experiences. LA De La Cruz, 6 out of 10. Some people's like three or four point like I said, if you're right on the fault line, it's like the epicenter, it's like freaking nuts, but sometimes, you know, a four or five point might not feel too bad. It all just depends. Alright, Cincinnati. Uh going to NL Central, Nancy. And ooh, how about out of twenty five Junior Cabanero? Out of 25. Tampa Bay Rays. That's AL East going to Nancy. And last but not least, ending it off with a Jason Dominguez. Nice two-color patch to 69. No, to 89. Yankees. Another one there for the AL East and Nancy. I don't know if I still have the recording. Let me see if I still have it in my archives. But uh, the biggest one that I the the one I felt the worst was was my was my, when I talked about my summer school. But the biggest earthquake I feel like I lived through was that one that happened I think in 2018 or 2019 that summer of 2018 19 when it was like a six point something. That shit was wild because I, I I still have the video of it. We went to go visit my parents, uh, coming back from. Um, Coming back from um, Palm Springs area. And I remember we stopped by just to change some clothes. Because we were going to this one festival called 626 Night Market. A lot of cool food, cuisine, stuff like that. And I just remember the RV, my parents' RV was like shaking, bro, like this. And I was outside with my, my parents and my, my in-laws. My wife was inside doing something. And I just remember like shaking so bad. I was like, whoa, dude, what the hell's going on here? Like, and it was just like shaking like crazy. This was nuts. Uh, thankfully, there was no damage, but you could totally see the RV moving in the video. But anyway, guys, thank you guys so much. That is Immaculate Baseball, one boxer. Very nice hits, actually. Guys, Jason Dominguez, Junior Caminero, Ellie. Some pretty nice stuff, guys. Appreciate it. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com.